Russia. We are in Moscow and this is Domodedovo International Airport. And today I'm not going to show you airport just a little bit because I already had many videos uh, from the airport. And uh, today I'm going to show you uh, um, a hotel which is near the airport. It's actually, if you would look in the window, it's right behind me. It's an air, air hotel. And uh, I want to show you because uh, maybe like some some of you would come and uh, would have to have to wait for the next flight for a long time, like I'm today. And you can actually go and rent an accommodation for a day. So um, um, I was I just came from Malaga and I'm flying from Moscow to my hometown, Sarat. And I have a very uh, a long waiting time before my flight, so I arrive just about seven o'clock, six o'clock in the morning. And I actually was flying with Ewing and I was really worried that it would be delays and because this airline delays quite often and it did delay. So um, I didn't take the ticket for the earlier flight to my town. So I took the latest one which would be 9 o'clock in the evening, 9 p.m. So uh, it's about uh, what, 16 hours of waiting time and so I decided to uh, have a hotel room for all this time and just wait for our flight. Um, usually we actually uh, drop the bags and just run around uh, Moscow city and enjoy the views but we've done it so many times and this time the weather is not very nice you can see behind me it's all cloudy and it's only 16 degrees so me and my husband we decided like okay maybe today we'll just go in a hotel and have some rest because we didn't have a good sleep on the airplane it was actually a five hour flight from Malaga to Moscow and we had not very comfortable seats as they didn't recline the full length both of our seats, I guess they were broken, I don't know and had so much of the back ache so that's why we decided let's just have a rest today and uh, so a little bit um, I'll show you uh, what the room would look like so um, the rate for the hotel end up is about 4,200 rubles which I think is about, depends what's the rate like right now ruble is 60 rubles uh, per dollar so it's end up about 70 dollars uh, for the day. So the day rate from 9 a.m. till 9 p.m. Uh, if you want, for example, go earlier uh, or um, like check in for the day for the night, it's like I think it's about 6,000. But I'm sure this this rate is a special rate, and it might be different. So it's very easy. You can uh, when if you arrive, you can go there are phone booths here, and if you dial zero four. Uh, the air, airport hotel, air hotel, uh, they will tell you the rate and available rooms. So it should be free Wi Fi. Um, what well, should be free Wi Fi? Two beds. So it's for two people the price I'm telling you. So I thought it's not bad price. There are also some other hotels which are about 10 15 minutes away. And I wasn't sure if I want to go there because it could be uh, traffic jams. And you know, sometimes they say 10 15 minutes. But it could end up maybe 20, who knows, because I have no idea where the other hotels are. That's why I decided to choose this one, because I can see this one. And the prices at this moment are about the same for all of them. So, and especially, I don't know, I had, a, there is one person standing there which looks like an official, but I had some other people coming to me and offering the other hotels, and I don't know who they are. It just doesn't, they don't have any official signs or anything on them. That's why, you know, I just decided, I know this, this hotel is right here. I'm going there. So I'm going to show it to you. And uh, also thinking to go and have a business lounge. Unfortunately, business lounge is only allowed to be for six hours. And it's about the same price per person, like 60 or 65 dollars per person. So for, for two of us, it would end up is quite expensive. That's why hotel room sounds quite nice, especially for uh, from 9 till 9, it's exactly what I need. And also with the business uh, lounge, you need to check in first, drop your bags, go through security, and then you can have an access. So um, it doesn't work for us well. That way, because the check-in is not open yet. You can drop the bags, but not the check-in. So, little bit of the airport. Look, it's... Um, uh, downstairs, it looks exactly the same as it looked uh, uh, before, previously. I don't know, I'm sure I had videos before. And I had the winter videos with the Christmas tree. And I think I did the summertime. Well, anyway, well, this is what the, the upstairs looks like now. Look, this is so beautiful. I, I wasn't here for a year, and, I, and uh, all of this was under construction. And now they finished. You can see all the cafes and uh, shops are uh, now there with the columns. It's very pretty. 
quality, I do really like it. There are enough plenty of uh, seats now and also they have plenty of power points. Before we had a struggle, we couldn't find the power point, it was only a few seats and uh, uh, now it's, it's a lot of uh, power points, no problem at all. And downstairs, as you can see, it's, it's exactly the same, this is where the check-ins are and it hasn't changed since uh, the last video I made, but upstairs looks really nice now. So this, uh, I like this uh, airport. It's uh, it's clean. It's not huge like, for example, Sheremetyo. I haven't been to Sheremetyo for ages. I don't even know what it looks like now. But in this one, last time was a year ago, so it's, uh, it's, it looks very nice and uh, very pretty. So um, well, that's all, guys, for now. I wanted to tell you, and that's the hotel. We're going in a minute. And it should be also a free shuttle from the gate number three. So we're going there and I'm going to show you what it looks like inside. Room. Let's start from a shower and the toilet is close to me. So this is what it looks like. It's not bad size, I guess. So we have, uh, this is a shampoo and the shower gel and the mirror. Hello, hello. Uh, also a hair dryer. So, uh, all right, doesn't look too bad. This is the economy room and I said it just doesn't have um, uh, good remodeling or something. So it's just like uh, quite simple. This is what it looks like. I have two beds, no air conditioning by the way. So I have a fan and it's not too hot today. <laughs> okay, so what do they have in here? No, they have some harness. Doesn't look like they have a safe. Maybe from the other side. No, I don't think so. Okay, and uh, so a bit old TV, but we have also a uh, mini bar which is uh, supposed to be included. So all the water and juice and some sweets, choco pie, all included in the price. So our room number 604. And uh, a little bit of the view which is not important because it's only for a few hours. Have a little rest and uh, so that's what the room looks like. Hey guys, um, to show you your room, not going to say goodbye just yet because uh, we're also thinking to have a lunch here and at 5 o'clock there will be a Russian tea party so it would be really interesting what they prepared so I'm going to make video of that. Also as far as I understand you can use here a sauna and a fitness, um, fitness uh, place so we ain't going to use it because we're only for a few hours so but I thought it was really nice. Also they have some ironing boards outside and I think you can also use it and um, uh, it's all included in price so uh, really cool okay had the shower and now time to have a little bit rest so I see you later for a lunch a little bit of the view of the restaurant buffet and it's 450 rubles per person I started from uh, one of the Russian soups which called borscht. The second I chose mashed potatoes with fish and some salads. You could have a choice liver, pork and chicken. Okay we are at Russian tea party now. Look how wonderful it is. We have donuts, we have different pies and that's called pryaniki, that's called sushki. We have another pie and very beautiful teapot which we call samovar look at this is so pretty i love these things i remember when i was a child we actually had one of these it's tea is beautiful in that thing so if you are going to be here don't miss it it's from five till six amazing it's included in your price so you don't have to pay any extra so now i'm going to have some beautiful beautiful tea with pasty okay we just come back from our russian tea party which was quite cool. I did really like the teapot. You saw uh, so beautiful, very pretty. I do really like to buy one of this and take you with me to Gibraltar. And uh, so I'm sitting here by the window, have a little bit of fresh air because, as I said, there is no air conditioning. And now the weather a little bit improved. It became quite warm, and uh, we have a ventilator, and it's not enough air because when you come out, you close the windows and come back, it's quite hot inside. So a little bit um, refreshing. I'm looking right at the, at the airport. So we will be going in a in minute. 
uh, started to get ready because uh, soon we would have to check in hopefully there are no delays and I'll be going um, to Saratov and the next video I'll show you uh, a review of uh, our local airlines it's my um, hometown airline uh, which was made in uh, Saratov so uh, I hope it's going to be interesting for you so you can have a look well hopefully it will be alright to make videos inside <laughs> I don't know how much it changed because the last last time I was flying on those air airlines it's like they were like air airline aircraft was like 30 years old and I heard that they uh, replaced them now so we'll see I guess we will notice the difference <laughs> because I was always so worried and scared to fly it's like on such old airplanes but um, Whatever was built in my town, in Saratov we had uh, an aviation uh, plant and uh, they did make a very good airplane, so they were saying they were, they were really, really good. So we will see. And uh, about the hotel, I did really like it, was impressed, really good service, very nice uh, food was pleasant. So 450 rubles per person, it's around uh, 7 dollars, uh, if uh, the ruble uh, 60 uh, rubles per dollar. It's about 60, 63 rubles per dollar, so it's end up about seven dollars uh, for um, buffet lunch. So it wasn't too bad. So um, that's all, guys. And uh, if you really like the video, don't forget to subscribe. And bye, everyone.